Hey guys, in this video, we're going to be checking out the 5 best budget 3D printers you can buy right now. I made this list based on my personal opinion and hours of research, and I've listed them based on print quality, ease of use, and price. I've included options for every type of consumer, so whether you're looking for a beginner level 3D printer or a more versatile model, we'll have the product for you. If you want more information and updated pricing on the products mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description below. Okay, so let's get started with the video. The first product on our list is the Monoprice Select Mini 3D Printer V2. This is our best budget 3D printer. If you're ready to test the waters of 3D printers and don't want to dive in the deep end financially, then the Monoprice Select Mini V2 is a great entry-level 3D printer. Currently priced at $200, the Monoprice gives you the core functions and features you need to get started. First, the Monoprice Select Mini V2 is an FDM printer, also known as Fused Deposition Modeling. It prints by squirting thermoplastic filaments through a hot nozzle and uses a variety of different types of filaments that melt, get shaped, and ultimately get molded. The Select Mini V2 has some nice upgrades from its previous model, especially in the print adhesion and overall print quality. It's still a Mini, so print area is relatively small, just under 5 by 5 inches, and you can go as high as a Coke can. It comes ready to go right out of the box thanks to pre-calibration, plus you'll find an SD card pre-loaded with a test print which is all great to help you jump right in. There's a nice screen that looks like it's a touch screen, but unfortunately is not, and you'll settle on using the dial to navigate everything. It's not quite as convenient, but you get used to it quite quickly. The user experience leans more to the functional side and may be a bit confusing for beginners. The all-metal hot end gives you quite a bit of flexibility in terms of filament types, so you can really experiment. Print resolution tops out at 100 microns, which is average for a budget model. The quality is good, but may take a few tries to experiment with the settings in order to get the best results, so you do need to be prepared for a bit of a learning curve. The pros are value. For the price, the V2 offers exceptional quality that goes above and beyond its class. Pre-calibrate. It's ready to go out of the box. You even get a test print to get you started. And for the cons, it's small. The build envelope of the V2 is small. The Monoprice Select Mini 3D Printer V2 is extremely affordable and offers solid print quality, well above most models in its class, making it ideal for hobbyists on a tight budget. Just be prepared for some tinkering time. The fourth product on our list is the 3D Creative Ender 5R Pro. This is our best value per dollar. Good 3D printers don't come any cheaper. The 3D Creative Ender 5R Pro is a robust printer with plenty of features and delivers great print quality. There's a lot of bang for the buck here, making it an extremely attractive option for beginners, hobbyists, and even seasoned makers. If you're a beginner, the 5R Pro is a natural starting point with its ease of use and beginner-friendly features. It even comes pre-calibrated right out of the box and assembly is super easy. Just 10 minutes and 20 screws and you're up and running for your first print. Hobbyists and makers will also find the Ender 5R appealing for the customization and upgrades that are available. The open frame style of the printer allows you to easily attach mods and extras, so you can really play around and push your creativity to new levels. The build of the machine itself is great. Other low-end models will use cheap acrylic or stamped steel, not the 5R Pro. Its primary structure is comprised of extruded aluminum. It also features a Bowden-style extruder, where the filament feeding mechanism is not attached to the extruder, making it much lighter, giving you faster and higher quality prints. Usually one of the most restrictive things about budget 3D printers is the limited build space. But unlike closed machines, the Ender 5R's open design provides more build area with less restrictions. The 3D Creative Ender 5R Pro is an FDM printer and loading filament is a breeze. Just select the preheat option in the menu, pinch the spring clamp on the feeder, and just push the filament all the way through until a bit comes out the heated nozzle. Then you're set and ready to print. The printer is relatively easy to use. You'll find convenient bed leveling knobs that'll help with manual calibration. 
On the right hand side of the printer, you'll also find an LCD display with a control wheel. There are also some nice features like the build tack, a print bed sticker that will help prevent fewer prints coming unstuck from the bed in the middle of your print. The pros are leveling, comes with large built-in leveling knobs to quickly level your bed. Pre-calibrate, it's ready to go out of the box. You even get a test print to get you started. Bowden style extruder, enables faster and higher quality prints. Build space, large build space, which is 8.6 by 8.6 by 9.8 inches high. And for the cons, bed adhesion. Some materials like ABS may experience bed adhesion, but adding some adhesive solution to the build plate should solve any issues. If you're in the market for a solid entry-level 3D printer, the 3D Creative Ender 5R Pro delivers the goods and is extremely wallet-friendly. The third product on our list is the Flash Forge Finder. This is our best 3D printer for beginners. The Flash Forge is one of the pioneers of 3D printing, and the Flash Forge Finder comes loaded with features and hits the sweet spot of performance, value, and usability, making it a great choice for beginners and hobbyists, currently priced at $349. The Flash Forge Finder does not have a heated print bed, so it prints using only PLA filaments, which is not a bad thing. It's one of the easiest 3D printing materials to work with, it's non-toxic, and produces a great surface finish. The finder may come across as simple, but you'll find it very versatile. For some beginners and even hobbyists, printing basic models in PLA may be all that's required. One thing to note, it may look like an enclosed unit, but the sides are actually open. Since it uses only PLA filament, the open sides don't affect the performance at all, so don't be alarmed when you first unpack it. You'll also love the 3.5-inch HD touchscreen display and the fact that it not only shows you previews of the model files before you print, but it also gives you a real-time printing status. The build area is slightly bigger than the Monoprice Select Mini, which is amazing considering the finder itself is only a 16.5-inch cube. One feature that beginners will appreciate is the intelligent assist leveling system that's usually only found on higher-ended machines. You also get built-in Wi-Fi that's not found on either the Monoprice Select Mini or the Ender 5R Pro. The pros are ease of use, plug and play, it doesn't really get any easier, connectivity, USB 2.0 cable, USB thumb drive, or Wi-Fi, display, 3.5 inch HD IPS touchscreen display, even showing you real-time status of your print. And for the cons, unheated print bed, Limited to printing with polylactic acid filament only with an unheated print bed. Proprietary filament. It uses a custom cartridge to store the PLA filament, making aftermarket PLAs difficult to use. Small volume. This 3D printer doesn't offer the largest build volume. The Flash Forge Finder is as close to a plug-and-play 3D printer as you can get at an affordable price. The print process is straightforward and very intuitive, making it ideal for beginners or hobbyists that don't need premium features. The second product on our list is the 3D Creative Photon 3 Pro. This is a great value per dollar DLP 3D printer. The 3D Creative Photon 3 Pro is one of the first SLA DLP printers to hit the market at an affordable price. The first thing you'll notice about the Photon 3 Pro is its physical small size when compared to other DLP printers. It's literally only about the size of two shoeboxes put together. You can put it right up on your desktop and watch it do its wonders. Unfortunately, the trade-off of having such a small footprint also means that you lose some build area. Unlike the three earlier printers on this video, the 3D Creative Photon 3 Pro is a DLP printer. This means that instead of squirting plastic filament through a hot nozzle to create objects, it shines UV light into a vat full of photoreactive resin to cure each layer. The good news is that the Photon 3 Pro comes fully assembled, so your first print is ready to go right after leveling your heating bed. It can be tricky for beginners, but it is essential, so you'll want to make sure you spend the time to do it correctly. There's an LCD touchscreen, and the UI is pretty simple and straightforward. However, it does not come with an automatic resin filler like some higher-end machines, so if your goo starts to run low, you'll have to pause the print to add more manually. 
you'd actually be surprised at how good the print quality is. This machine produces surprisingly accurate details and is capable of printing layers thinner than 10 microns, making it far more detailed than even most high-end FDM 3D printers. The pros are affordable. This is one of the most affordable resin-based 3D printers around. Print, extremely high detail prints. Touchscreen, the display is touchscreen and the UI is simple and intuitive. And for the cons, resin filler. It's not automatic, so you'll have to keep an eye on the goo level. No peel mechanism, can be prone to incomplete peels. Small volume, this 3D printer doesn't offer the largest build volume. The 3D Creative Photon 3 Pro has solid features, great print quality, and is very user-friendly, making it ideal for beginners and hobbyists looking to work with an entry-level DLP 3D printer at an affordable price. The first product on our list is the Monoprice Voxel 3D Printer. This is our best overall 3D printer. The Monoprice Voxel's affordable price may suggest it's an entry-level printer, but the high print quality and feature set can easily put it on par with many higher-end machines. It's perfect for hobbyists looking to upgrade to more features and options, while its ease of use makes it an attractive machine for beginners, too. The Voxel's great user experience hits the sweet spot for all levels of users, and is currently priced at $400. The Monoprice Voxel is designed with a closed frame and comes pre-assembled and pre-calibrated so it's ready to print out of the box. A closed frame has its benefits, less noise, good safety from the hot liquids, and of course less smell, especially if you work a lot with ABS. There's also an intuitive 2.8 inch touchscreen, making it easy for beginners to jump right in with their first print. With the enclosed print space and heated print bed, you'll be able to print with either PLA or ABS in impressive resolutions from 50 to 300 microns and get speeds up to 60 millimeters per second. Removing completed prints on budget printers have seen their share of problems, but thanks to Voxel's flexible and removable build plate, the prints are quite easy to remove. Just a little flex and your creation pops off easily without damage. In fact, this build platform is one of Voxel's best features. It includes a specially designed surface texture that helps the first layer of prints to stick properly, so you get a good solid foundation for the rest of your model. You'll find you get no warping with minimal stringing on your print, as well as excellent bridging and overhangs. You'll also be thoroughly impressed with the level of fine details printed in layers as small as 50 microns. This is no ordinary entry-level printer. The pros are quick change nozzle. The Voxel has a quick change nozzle that allows you to change the nozzle in seconds without the need for tools. Flexible build plate. The removable flexible build plate makes removing your print a breeze. Auto feeding with filament sensor. Loading is easy with the auto filament loading feature. Print options. This printer can print via ethernet, Wi-Fi, or from a USB thumb drive. And for the cons, touch screen. Slightly bulky at times. Filament spool. The proprietary filament spool makes it difficult to use third-party filaments. The Monoprice Voxel's high print quality and feature set can easily put it above its class, making it appealing for all levels of hobbyists and makers. It's simply one of the best all-around 3D printers out there. Alright guys, that's all for now. If you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and leave a like. If you're new to the channel and you like the video, consider subscribing. We do our best to keep you up to date with the best products on the market right now. So if you want to stay current regarding the best gear, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Be sure to check out the description for links to find the most up-to-date pricing on all the products mentioned in this video. Hope you all have a great day and we'll see you back here soon for the next video.